Welcome to another thrilling installment of Snakebird Solutions. Uh, this is level four star, star four, four, four star, star four, I believe. Okay. Um, looking at this, to get the three snakes out, working backwards to, to get the three snakes out, uh, we need to one of these uh, blocks on top of here and then it just climbs out uh, so intuitively the idea is that we need to stack all of the each of the three uh, blocks on top of the spikes uh, so for each one there's a question of is it going to stick out this way Or is it going to stick out the other direction? Uh, and you can actually reason if you were to have them all stick out to the left. Like this. Uh, you actually can't make it from here. You can't make it on top of the the last you can't get a snake on top here because it's too far from this side and there's no way to get on top on the right side this is too far for a three snake i mean a three snake can only go here it either would be standing here and go to here or it would be standing here and fall through so uh, we don't actually want them to stick out to the left. We want them to stick out to the right. Like so. This is what we're trying to create. If we do this, then no matter where the snake is, the snake can climb onto here, onto here, onto here over here it'll fall down and then it climbs up and then it goes out that's what we're trying to do um the only thing to note is we can't drop any of the the pieces to the ground if we drop it to the ground then we can't um we can't lift it back up there's no way to lift it back up okay so let's start this first we just need to move uh, the bottom one on top of the bottom spike. Like so. We want it like that. So that should be pretty straightforward. Oops. <laughs> that should be pretty straightforward. We just move it over. Done. Okay, no problem. Um, next. We want to get one of these, one of these two, on top of here. So we need to lift it up to and then push it over. Um, red is holding things up, so we're just going to reposition. Sorry, green is holding things up. We're just going to reposition red. Um, and we just have to keep it off the ground. So we move that. Okay. So we moved them over one. Uh, so one thing to note is at this point, if we were to push this over, here. Uh, here. I'll demonstrate, actually. So let's say we push this over. Now we have a problem in that green can't, the green snake can't, whoops. 
The green snake now can't get over. It's stuck. It's stuck on the side. Um, so we actually don't want to do that. We could even do this uh, on the other side. But the problem is we can't lift up. We can no longer lift. We can no longer lift this this rod because there's no way to get under it. Uh, we could maybe push it back to be able to, to get under it, but it, we can't actually push it back either given its position. So, uh, so we actually need to avoid placing a piece here. Let's back up. Okay, so from this position, we can avoid placing... Oops. <laughs> we can avoid placing one of the bars here by positioning red, like so. Now when we push over the bar, Uh, it doesn't fall in, and then we can position it on top of Spike. Okay, so now we just have the final one, and the final piece is, I think, the easiest one to position. Um, it's fine if either of these drop. Oops, wrong way. There we go. Now we've positioned all three bars in place and we can just exit. And as demonstrated, even if this was on the bottom, snake just exits. And that's it. That's the solution to four, four star. Star four. Thanks for watching.